Hey guys, in today's video, I wanted to try out the Project Mist demo. Project Mist was first teased on YouTube about 11 months ago, and it looked really interesting. It's basically a survival game with a bunch of monster aspects added to it. Six months ago, they had added another trailer, uh, which showcased a little bit more to the game, and it looked very interesting. And recently, about October 3rd, they came out with the demo. So I thought I might as well try it out and see how the game is in its current state. Now, of course, with how games and early access and demos work, this is very broken and in a very bare bones state. I guess in today's video, we're going to look and see what is currently in the game, what you can actually do, and how it feels. Ooh, options, graphics. Game's still in a very bare bones state. I can see that. Oh. I heard something. There was some life. Ooh, okay. Uh, small food can, E. Alright, I have like a little cloth. Interesting. Press M to open the map. Ah, oh, look at that. Contamination zone. So train mobile base player. Alright. Proceed to crowd or crawl. Okay. Going into here. What's up, bro? Anything in here? Ooh. Okay, so it's telling me like to Alright, well that was not like Ah, the right click does it. Okay. We got we got to do this the way it says. Hold up, hold up, hold up. We got to do it the exact way it says. You know, these boxes need to get out of the way, though. So like it says in the tutorial, here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Game changing. And look, there's a chest here now. This is probably already here, but... <clears throat> Let's see. Ooh. Spin it. Wait a minute, wait a minute, no, can't cheat it, can't cheat it, go back, go back. Hold up, I'm lost. I'm unlocking the easter egg. Come on. Alright, I don't think this does anything. Alright, let's go, let's go back right. Alright, so we can use the ladder now. This one is... Okay, so we gotta grab a log. And he has a menu too. How did he get that menu? Ah, tab. Log foundation. Okay, so I need to do this like this. Uh, how do I get rid of this, though? Okay, I guess it's gone now. Interesting. Okay. I think this tutorial is pretty, pretty okay. I guess I should probably check my inventory, right? <gasps> oh, wait a minute. Hold up. That's actually, I, I'm not gonna lie, it's not anything insane, right, whenever you think about it, like, like the actual, how, it, how it's supposed to be, but to have an in inventory like this, hey, to be different from the norm, I like that. It doesn't seem like you can go too far away from it, though. It kind of just does that. I'm getting my first gun, a crossbow. Oh, shit. Alright, well, I got a crossbow, and I got a frag grenade. Right off the bat, feeling the way the crossbow feels... This doesn't feel, like, terrible. It actually feels pretty hefty and pretty fine. With the animation feel and all that. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait, I think I missed. Oh, they have... Okay. Alright, bro. I think maybe I gotta shoot, like, the little bubbles on them. I think that's their weak points. Ooh, you can also grab the crossbow bolts. This is just basically a gravity gun from Gmod. That's all this is. Damn, that box. That box is insane. Infected water. Ooh, the axe. I like puzzles. I like puzzles. We're doing fine. We're doing fine. Can I break this? Break this? Okay, thank God. A hey, save here. Some blood orbs. I don't know what the blood orbs do yet. Copper ore. Ooh. Some alcohol. Cloth. Wait, is there already autosave in this game? That's cool. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Open crafting station. Looks 
like you do this. Oh, so then the craft of this, it is an alcohol wipe plus, or just alcohol plus cloth, I'm guessing is what it is. Ah. Oh. Craft mechanical part, open inventory, use gravity gun to put it here. Oh, I see. So this just requires one copper, I guess. Let's see, drop it is E, then pick it up with this and place it. Perfect. It worked. All right. Look at that. Look at that big motherfucker right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm low on water, actually. Hold up. Let's uh, let's actually drink. But I do have some filtered water. Let's consume this with F. Interesting. So food on the bottom left is just like five little dots, and same thing with water. I didn't really, I didn't notice that till now. Looks like an oil rig or something, or I guess it's a piece of a bridge. <clears throat> All right, let's see. What's up here? All right. <laughs> Let's try this again. Let's just see. Let's just see. I'm gonna get off as soon as I get to this. Hurry, hurry. Alright, we're good. We're good. We're good, dude. We didn't die that time. So, I did see that it said that there was a train. And I think that is what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to ride a train in this. Wait, why is there a crafting bench on either, each side? Oh, this is like an upgrade station. Oh, so this is what these uh, blood things are for. The blood orbs. So dash, press jump button, spacebar, and right left uh, movement to dash. Movement speed upgrade increases movement speed. Um, gravity rip allows you to rip augmentations and weak points off enemies using the gravity gun. Divine shield, when your health reaches zero, become unkillable for three seconds. Uh, the last bullet in each magazine stuns an enemy. Inventory display can block some projectiles. What? So you're telling me that if I do this... I can block some projectiles using my inventory. I need a monster blood orb for that. Okay. Uh, upgrades inventory bot with an inventory safety guard turret that shoots at nearby enemies. So this one will uh, make the inventory kill people too. <laughs> Adds few inventory spaces. Uh, so this is inventory upgrades. Uh, this is max health. Up so these are like base stats. So inventory, health, I'm guessing max shield. Yeah, and then max uh, stamina. Okay. Paraglider. Hold the jump button while falling to use paraglider. Allows you to pull yourself towards special gravity anchors using the gravity gun. Allows you to equip items while using paraglider. Uh, unlocks blueprint for gravity anchor structures. Allows you to control small monsters and critters using parasites. Shoot small monsters with a parasite to attach it to them. It will follow you and attack your enemies. If you shoot a parasite into ground, it will summon controlled monsters. Allows you to control all creatures smaller than humans using parasites. So these, this is like a weird parasitic type of thing, huh? Allows you to pick up small monsters and critters using the gravity gun. This is a gravity gun increase, and then... Tame and ride a barnacle. Man, so many of them require a monster blood orb. Let's just save. Let's just save. Right? Let's, let's let's not do anything rash yet. All right. We've arrived somewhere. We're going to save. We're going to save before we go down this elevator. I don't trust elevators anymore. So, I really don't I, I don't trust elevators anymore in this game. Let's do chests, I guess. Let's build one of these. Oh, so that's the resources I need to make a chest. I think that worked. I, I'm i guessing in order to add stuff to this, I maybe have to drop it. Right? But, like, let's just do the infected water, right? Because we can't even really do anything with this. Alright, well that worked just about as I expected. Alright. Did I save before we got there? I did not. All right. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ride back over there. All right. Before we do anything, anything, save. Ain't risking that again. Okay, so that's built. I do not know how to put stuff into this.
What? How did I make that into lemon water? Yeah, I don't know how to put stuff in this. I really don't. Alright, real question though. Will this kill us? This. <laughs> Alright, so maybe I'm not supposed to be able to go down this yet. Let's keep going. Let, let's keep it going. What about this? Man, why do they not work? I I, I don't know. I guess let's, let's just keep going through the train, right? Ooh. Ooh. What happens if I crash into this? Okay. Yeah, look at this. I'm pretty sure we have to go into the towers, get three things, come back, place three keys here, and it opens up like a big boss room. Let's go back, though. Oh, God. It does not like going backwards. Oh, man. I think the concept for this game, though, I, I do like the concept. It has a cool concept and a premise, right? It's interesting, unique. The inventory shit is cool. It's not something that's game-changing, though. Like, it's it's cool, but not game-changing, right? I just really wish that the game worked, though. I want to test this out, though. I want to see. I'm going to save the game, and then we're going to quit the game. All right. Well, it is not just a save. Got it. <laughs> God, what happened to my train? <laughs> All right. This, uh, there's a chance this breaks. Oh. Hey, it corrected itself. Let's see if the water works like Minecraft, right? It does. We're good. We're good. We're kind of good. Alright, that worked. I can't see anything, by the way. Like, you guys can see more in OBS, I think, than I can see. Because it's, it's so dark on my monitor. <gasps> oh, what the hell is that thing? Oh, it died in like one hit. It's so hard to see. Is there, uh, is there an option for that? Brightness? It's all the way maxed. There's no way. Nothing is inside of that. Oh, it's a deer. Framework unlocked. Palisade. Ah, there it is. Interesting. Okay. I need to unlock a torch. Ooh, fire! How do I ignite it? I don't think I can. Alright, let's try this. Let's see. Uh, utilities, cooking station. It says it needs a log, it looks like. Let's see. Oh, perfect. Two logs. Put ingredients into a pot with your gravity gun to make meals. So, if I were to put the meat into here. Look at that. Look at that. It's cooking. Yeah, this doesn't really add much light, though. E. Oh. Meat stew. A hundred hunger. Oh, wait a minute. It does look like it's kind of doing something now. Okay. Okay. Yeah, there we go. So it's just buggy on the train. I guess let us just explore a little bit. Let's just see if we can find anything. There's a possibility. Oh, look at him. He's huge. Arger. What the? Oh, shit. Okay, he's nerfed by trees. But he pounces. Alright. Well. <laughs> there we go. He's dead. We killed the big boy. Monster blood ore, baby. And blueprint unlocked. Damage increased. Enjoy your upgrade. Hey. So with the monster orb, we should be able to craft that uh, the upgrade right. In the upgrade station. Oh. 
That's new. Oh my god, he blew up. I'm gonna die. Oh god, my FPS. Oh god. These things are so tanky for small looking mobs. What the hell? I know I'm not hitting like the, the weak spots though. Okay, they all dead? Are we good? I think we're good. We're good. We're good. Ooh, a handgun. Ooh. Hey, look at this. Look at this bad boy. Oh, yeah. I'm really hoping this thing doesn't, like, whenever I shoot it, it's not the loudest thing I've ever heard in my life. I guess it's just, like, an altar or something. Let's hope that whatever's inside of here can maybe help me. Never mind. I, I don't think... I don't think whatever's in there can help me. I'm so dead. I, whatever's... Yep. We are so dead. Oh, the autosave! Wait! The autosave come in clutch? It did not. It did not. Oh, it almost did, though. Alright, but I tried it out. I think it's a cool game. I think the concept's cool. I just think the game is really, really, really buggy right now. And they, they definitely need to...